Hi you guys, it's Stephanie with Coffee Paper Scissors and I am getting to work on the three ring binder cookbook that I'm making for a friend to give to her granddaughter. So I, I showed you guys this at the end of my last video, but just in case you haven't seen that, then I will show you again. I bought this cookbook, um, it, it was a cookbook, at a thrift store for a dollar. And on the front of it, or on the cover of it, it had this really shiny paper. So I took a razor blade, not a real sharp one. I mean, it's paper. You don't have to have a real sharp one, um, but anything sharp. And I went around the, just the white paper. And then I got up underneath it with my fingernails and just kind of peeled it. And um, it peeled off pretty easily. I don't know that all of them would, but uh, it did peel off pretty easily. And this is nice and thick. Um, and it did come away just a little bit in a couple of places, so I glued it back down. But it's a really thick um, board that it's on, so that's good. And the insides um, were here, and there's nothing special about these insides. I'm not going to use any of them um, to put back in here. I don't know if I'll use them in, in um, the future, but there's no fun pictures. It was a celebrity, dining with celebrities. Dining with hmm, desert celebrities. Okay. Anyway, nothing special as far as the pages go, but what was really cool, and this just happened to be the case, is six inches. So I was able to take 12 by 12 pages and fold them in half to make these and then I used my um, envelope maker to, to do the tabs. So, and then also I went through these and I was like, okay, yeah, appetizers sound good, beef sounds good, bread sounds good. And, and I thought, well, I'll use the same categories. And then I came across certain ones that were just like entrees and I thought, well, because I don't want it to be too awfully thick with my own stuff that she can't put stuff in there. So I didn't do like entrees or healthy choice. Um, like back here, it's rest favorite restaurants. So I guess these celebrities are talking about different places that they would go to. I, I don't know for sure. Anyway, so I'm using what I took out of it as my template basically. And so here is this. I had talked in my last video about going on to Etsy and trying to find a digital kit. And what I was finding was something that I didn't think, or since I don't know the girl, um, I felt like it was something that I would like, but not something that somebody who is in her very early 20s would like. So I decided to go through my scrapbook paper and I found, uh, these are from three, no, two different paper packs. This paper pack and this paper pack that I've used, you know, in other things. And I just decided to use these pages to make um, the separators. So now I'm going to use one of the separators from the um, cookbook to do the hole punching. So the way I did it, you guys, was I did the fold over here because I was going to have to cut this off anyway and... Um, I was just like, well, I, I, so what I'm saying is it doesn't matter either way. You're going to have to glue one side or the other. And since this was going to have to be cut and this was going to have to be cut, I felt like it didn't matter. Um, so my fold is on this side, but the fold could be on this side, whatever you want. If you don't have an envelope maker, you could, um, and you want to do something like I'm doing, you could use the ones that are in here and you could, you know, cut them yourself. Uh, but I had the envelope maker, so that's what I did. So, and I'm not going to make you sit and watch me do all of these, but I will go ahead and um, 
just kind of line them up. The holes are a little bit bigger than my hole punch. Those are some pretty big holes. So there's that. And then on this side, I did do a little um, thumb hole punch. And I like to use the ovals, but that's just me. And then I'm leaving it open, um, you know, hence the thumb hole punch, so that she can put stuff down in there if she would like to. And then we're just gonna glue it. Make sure there's plenty of glue. So I don't know if you guys um, have something like this. I do, and I do use it. Um, I have, I have one of these, and I also have like a recipe box. And I don't, I don't have a ton of recipes that I go to all the time. I, I don't cook a lot anymore. My family. My goodness, you guys, they're the pickiest eaters. Um, so it's really not satisfying cooking for them because I will put, you know, an hour or so into something and none of them are like, great, mom, thanks, or whatever. And so I just don't really do it anymore. Um, but I do have, you know, recipe books and, and I use them. So hopefully she will too. Now, this, you know, it seems like there's a lot of space, but I'm using the template. This is gonna be loud. Sorry about that. I just wanted to close it so that you would see, you know, when it's it lines up perfectly with, you know. So anyway, that is what I am going to sit here and do. And I made sure, um, I, I did my folding and my, my um, tab making page by page so that I could kind of get, uh, they don't go together, you know, they're not like a matchy, 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 but I was trying to get at least some sort of, I didn't want to have like all blues, then all reds, then all blacks. I was trying to have it kind of be more, more patterned in that way, if that makes sense. Anyway, I just thought I would do a couple of these with you. It's gonna be a very short video, but there's no sense in you sitting and watching. Um, I think you get the point. And I'm gonna be doing some, some labels to put on here. And I'm also going to be making pages where um, she can fill out with additional recipes that she comes across at some point. And I'll be putting pockets. <clears throat> so there's a shower and that's where grandma's gonna give her this. I'm, I'm assuming, I, I don't know if it's a wedding gift or a shower gift, I don't know. Um, but what was I gonna say? <laughs> I lost my train of thought. I totally lost my train of thought. Oh, they're going to be doing um, recipe cards. You know, everybody's supposed to bring a recipe, like their favorite recipe or whatever. And so I'll be putting pockets or something. I'm not sure what I, exactly I'm going to be putting in at this point, but I'll be putting in something for her to be able to put those recipes that she's getting. It must be a shower um, that she's planning to give her this for. But anyway, in between these folders, okay, loud noise again, you guys. Um, in between, I'll be putting pages that she can write recipes and some pockets for the ones that she's been given at the shower. I forgot to glue that. Um, but it's gonna be kind of the same in between each one and then I'll label it. And really, you guys, that's about all that I have for right now. I'm going to sit here and finish gluing these. And again, I did, you know, each one. There's a set of three. And I, I did it. I folded it as I was going about so that I didn't goof anything up. 
And I know that this looks like a whole bunch of crazy colors all together. And, you know, we're going to see together how it turns out. I hope it works. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, so that's all I have. Thanks, you guys, for watching. And I will talk to you soon. Bye.